Hi guys, my name is Shubhan Garodia, Chemistry Master Teacher at Vedantu. Today we are going to talk about JE Advanced 2021 Paper 1, Chemistry Section and Question Number 16. Okay, now this is a multiple correct type question guys, so be careful. He says you have a mixture of two salts in which when you react them with dilute ethyl, you get only white color PPT. If you react them with dilute NaOH, you again get a white color PPT. And then we are given some cations here that we are supposed to test. Thick. So let's quickly talk about all the cations given here and therefore we'll have our answer. Let's go ahead. First cation given to us was Pb2 plus, then we had Zn2 plus, then one of the cations was Bi3 plus, then the other was a Hg2 plus, one was Ag plus, lead, zinc, yeah, these many. Now let's first check their reaction with dilute HCl. When you react them with dilute HCl, we get PbCl2 which is white, we get ZnCl2 which is soluble. If you remember, dilute HCl or tap water add currency, Bi3 plus salts undergo partial hydrolysis and form BiOCl ka white turbidity or white PPT. Hg2 plus will form HgCl2 which is soluble in nature and Ag plus will form AgCl which is white. Okay. Let's do the same analysis when we react them with dilute NaOH and let's see what do we get. Thick. So first we get lead hydroxide that is white. We are not given your excess NaOH so I'm not dissolving, I'm not dissolving them. Then you'll have ZnOH twice which is white. Thick. Then we have BiOH thrice which is again white. Hydroxide PPT of bismuth. Hg2 plus and Ag plus do not form their hydroxide PPT when they react with NaOH, they rather form their oxide PPT directly. So you'll get HgO here which is yellow and here you'll have uh, yellow or yeah, uh, red depending on the temperature and Ag ke saath you'll get Ag2O which is brown black. Okay, so definitely guys, uh, because in the question it says only white PPT is needed. Let's go back to our option. Silver option cancelled because Ag2 was black. Hg option cancelled. Why? Hg option cancelled because uh, HgO was uh, either yellow or red depending on the temperature. Now, both of these are possible answers A as well as B because they don't they do not say that uh, both of the compounds have to form a precipitate. Even if we get one white precipitate and the other is soluble, that should be marked as an answer here. Therefore, the answer here is A as well as B. Thank you so much for joining us guys and stay tuned for our next question.